So I don't know if you know that, guys, but um, I, I'm working for Boom Radio, yeah. and it's a, a, a web radio, you know, on okay. internet. Great. And we've got your, your radio station. It's called uh, the Jonas Brothers Radio. Yeah. And uh, we're playing your, your songs like all over again, and there's like thousands and thousands of them. That's awesome. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you for playing so much. You want to shut the window, or is it okay? Oh, it's okay for me. All right, it's okay. Okay, so first of all, how do you like Paris? Love it. It's one of my favorite cities. Actually, it's my favorite city in the world. I love it here. Mm -hmm. Shopping, the food, fashion, fans, they're all very sweet. Um, and uh, we love going here every time. Mm -hmm. do, you, do you speak a little French? Bonjour. Comment ça va? Right? Comment ça va? Or bye. Very good. Okay. That's very good. Sure. Okay, so you're young and you're already like superstars. And um, earlier I post on my Twitter, you know, that I was doing this interview, and there were like tons and tons wow. of, of, of um, comments on it. How do you deal with it? Because you're so young, like, can you still have a life? Of course, you know, each one of us has our own personal interests, and beyond that, you know, we have our own personal lives as well. But for us, you know, um, our life is the band. You know, we are doing this every single day. Um, traveling, you know, doing that, and it's, it's a lot of fun. We enjoy it. And so you're back with a new album, which is called A Little Bit Longer. Um, how is it to record this album in the studio, and in what this album is different from the, the other ones? Actually, the most recent album is called Lines, Minds, and Trying Times. The one before that was called A Little Bit Longer, but uh, Lines, Minds, and Trying Times is great to, to, to record. And, mm -hmm. um, to have four albums released in three and a half years was a, a lot of fun. Also a lot of recording and a lot of writing, but it was it was great, and we're so thankful that people around got the CD and, and like it. And when you're working, you know, for for an album, uh, what shoes? Like who's the <laughs> bus? Like <laughs> I think for us, when we're choosing songs, we sit around together and decide which is our favorite song, and then uh, everybody kind of has their opinion. Managers, record label, because we just send in a lot of music just for people to listen to and get their opinion. Usually, we come with our favorites first and have a list of our favorites, but we send about, we recorded probably 60 songs for the last album. Oh, that's, that's a lot. And what's the worst thing that happened to you on stage? The worst thing? Yeah. I think for me, um, probably the worst thing was falling on stage, but I fell at the American Music Awards and I cut my, uh, this was a couple of years ago, I cut my knee and uh, it was on television, so a lot of people saw it, but nothing too bad. Yeah, I'm asking this question because yesterday I was um, doing an interview with Justin Bieber. Oh, yeah. And mm -hmm. he talked about you because he saw you in the airport and he told me that you were talking. And what do you think of his music and what do you think of him? I think that uh, he kind of, as far as fan reaction goes, reminds us of us a little bit. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's cool to see someone coming up who's really passionate about the music, and uh, it seems like he's going to be making music for a while, so we'll have fun. Yeah, that's very good. Mm -hmm. said the same thing to you. So. Um, I know that you are, like, actors, and um, what, do you like better, like, to act or to sing? And could you, like, stop making music for, like, a big movie, for being in a big movie or something like that? I think we like when we can combine the acting and singing, like what we've been able to do with Camp Rock, Mm -hmm. um, that's been cool for us, but also uh, I, I think that we individually have different preferences. For me personally, music comes first. I know for Joe that he's looking forward to doing some more acting as time goes on. <laughs> and Kevin is actually looking to start directing, so being behind the scenes. And we each have different preferences, but um, as far as the group goes, we like combining music and acting. So, as I said earlier, you're like young, and um, I was just wondering, what are you watching on TV, like shows and stuff? Uh, our, fa our favorite shows are, uh, there's a show called Flash Forward, mm -hmm. it's really good, there's a show called Glee, mm -hmm. it's really great, and uh, I like Top Chef. House as well. House is for Kevin, Nick loves Heroes, but I'm a, I'm, I'm a big Flash Forward fan, I haven't oh, caught up yet in the season, so catch up, man. I'm, I'm a little, uh, two episodes behind, so I just gotta watch them on the next play right. <laughs> um, I bet you guys have an iPod. What what kind of music like do you like to listen and 
What, what's your favorite song right now? Like the song that you can listen to like all again and again and again. Um, we're big Kings of Leon fans, um, so that whole record is great. We listen to that all the time. Um, I knew a Pixie Lot song actually called "Cry Me Out," mm -hmm. which is great. Um, those are the recent ones, but we're into the classics as well. <laughs> so like Elvis Costello, Johnny Cash, Prince, all their music is great. Okay, you know. Um, in front of this auto, there's a lot of fans, and uh, some of them are asking, oh, you have to ask them if they're single. So I have to ask you, are you guys single? I'm so sorry. Well, Kevin's get, getting married, he's engaged, so yeah. he's not single. Oh, but yeah, he's yeah, the only one getting married, so he's the only one taking. Well, congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, so you guys are so talented, and I was just wondering, um, if you had to sing a song about friends, how would it sound like? We actually have a song about friends. It's called Just Friends. Um, the Rose Friends. Of uh, France or Friends? France. France. Oh, I apologize. <laughs> um, how would it sound? It would sound like nut Nutella and crepes mixed with um, macarons in your mouth. Can you sing something for us? I don't know how that would sound, but that's how it would <laughs> feel in your body. Yes. Oh, how? No. <laughs> <laughs> Period um, answer. And steak frites. And steak frites. Ooh, and steak frites. Ooh, I'm hungry now. I know, me too. Me too. <laughs> I'm hungry. Um, how long are you staying in Paris? Uh, um, we leave yeah. right after the show. T t tomorrow, tonight is our um, the last concert of the tour. Mm -hmm. So, very exciting. And are you ready for the show? Like, do you have, like, like are you praying before? Or do you have to? Of course, we have. Uh, we have a lot of. We call them rituals, we just do them before we have a lockdown where no one comes in and out except we do vocal warm-ups and we pray, we do a chant as a band, and then we go underneath the stage and um, get zoned out and we dance around underneath the stage. A lot of things go into it, but this is going to be a party tonight because it's the last day, so there's going to be some crazy stuff going on. What do you think is the best thing about like being famous? Doing what you love. Mm -hmm. We never wanted to be famous, we just wanted to live out our dreams. And that's what we do every day. That's beautiful. Do you have a word for your fans? We love you. Two of them. Two of them, all the fans. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.